In this tutorial, you will learn how to use the PebbleGo Next States database. We're going to start from methactin.org. If you are logging into Chromebooks, you will already be on your student launch page. If you are going from home, you need to go to www.methactin.org and then click on the star or my MSD. That will bring you to your intranet homepage or your student landing page. You will look for the library resources icon. Your icon may look a little different than mine, but if you click on the library resources icon, it will bring you to all of the district library resources. You will be able to get to Noodle Tools, Culture Grams, Yale Databases, Power Library, World Book Encyclopedia, right from this page. Right now, Pebble Go Next is not one of your options. So to get there, we're going to click the Destiny icon. We're going to choose Skyview. And here is our home page. You're going to go down to where the databases are listed and click Pebble Go Next. That will bring up the Pebble Go Next database. Today, we are using the States database. When you click on the states database, it gives you different regions. I'm going to choose Northeast, and in fact, I am going to choose the state of Pennsylvania. When you get to the Pebble Go Next database, you will notice a few things. One, it will actually read to you. If you press the button, Pennsylvania is in the northeastern United States near the East Coast. New Jersey is on its eastern edge. To the south is Maryland. So if you have a need to play the, the um, audio part, it will actually read to you. What I would like for you to notice is that the database is set up like a nonfiction book. At the top, we have various tabs that lead to further information. This is similar to a table of contents in a nonfiction book. Also available is a dictionary, which is very much like a glossary in a nonfiction book. We can take one of these um, <clears throat> words that are down in the, the, um, the text and we can put them into the dictionary and it will tell us what the word means. There's no need for you to have to worry about what a word means if you don't understand it. You have a dictionary available right to you. In order to um, do this project, you are going to have to do a citation. Luckily, Pebble Go Next provides the very citation you need and you do not have to fill in all of the little bubbles on your paper to get it. All you have to do is look here under print MLA. Remember, at Skyview, we use MLA format. All you have to do is either copy and paste this or um, copy and paste it, or you can push print MLA. And it actually will print it for you, but since you have to put it into a Google slide anyway, copying and pasting may be a better idea for you. So all you have to do is copy and paste the citation into the Works Cited page on your Google Slides. What I want you to notice is that each of these tabs also leads to other information that you are going to need to use in your project. Um, you have a, a slide that for industry in Pennsylvania. You have a slide for famous people. You can just scroll down and find famous people for different states in the union. Remember, you are not copying and pasting information. You are reading, then you are going to your Google Doc and you will um, put your information from your memory into your slide. Each slide in your 
Google presentation has a different aspect that you will get information from Pebble Go next, you will get information from World Book Online, and you will get information from Culturegrams. You will use this information to write your sentences, you'll synthesize your information, and then you will create your 30-second commercial for your state. Some of the pictures that you put into um, this Google pre slide presentation will be used in your final project and you will also create your works cited page. Notice how I copied and pasted right here from the Pebble Go database. I don't like the way it looks so I will expect you to at, do the same as I will do and I will retype the citation into my works cited page. And that is how we use the Pebble Go Next database. I also want you to notice that there is also a science database and an American, industry, American Indian history database available. Thank you.